Hello everybody, my name is Miss Betsy and I'm with Community United Methodist Church and this is Children's Church. I'd like to welcome everybody today and I'm really glad that you are with us. I have something here with me. Oh, what is that? Looks like a gift bag, huh? wonder what's in my gift bag. Let's see. That's kind of a strange gift, huh? What does this remind you of? Let's look at all the pieces here. There's a pumpkin. There's a fall leaf. There's a corn stalk. There's some berries. And there's a dried twig. Does that make you think of a holiday? Hmm. Do you think maybe Thanksgiving? I bet that's what it is. It's Thanksgiving. All of these things that we see in my little branch here are things that we see at Thanksgiving. Do you have a favorite thing at Thanksgiving? Is it the turkey? Is it dessert? Is it a favorite casserole? Is it getting to go be with family maybe? Or having um, a day off from your chores or school or anything like that? Is that part of Thanksgiving for you? Well, since Bible times, people have gathered to give thanks. They gave thanks to God for the harvest. They gave thanks for him taking care of them through the season and through the year. And they give thanks for him uh, providing all of the things that they needed. Um, we still give thanks today. We give thanks when we eat our meals. We give thanks at church when we are um, in service. Um, and ever since Bible times, people have gathered together to pray and give thanks and sing praises to God for all the blessings that he has given them. In the United States, we have a day set aside for that, and it's called Thanksgiving. We should thank God for all of our blessings every day, for, for our food, for our home, for our family. We should thank God for our blessings every day. And um, I would like to read a Thanksgiving hymn to you now. Um, now thank we all our God with hearts and hands and voices who wondrous things has done, in whom this world rejoices, whom from our mother's arms has blessed us on our way with countless gifts of love and still is ours today. O oh, may this bounteous God through all our life be near us with every joyful heart and blessed peace to cheer us. And keep us still in grace, and guide us when perplexed, and free us from all ills in this world and the next. All praise and thanks to God, the Father now be given, the Son and Him who reigns with them in highest heaven, the one eternal God whom earth and heaven adore, for thus it was, is now, and shall be evermore. On Thanksgiving, we especially thank God with our hearts and our voices. And so right now I'd like to pray. Let's have a, a Thanksgiving prayer. God of love, we thank you for everything you have given us. Help us to share what we have with others. We love you. Amen. Don't forget that this is also a season when we should think about others. So if, you're, if your parents are getting ready to help maybe give food to the food bank or to a homeless shelter or to the church so that they can distribute it to people who don't have as much as we do, then be sure that you help them do that. Okay? Next week, we'll have a craft. And I'm going to go ahead and tell you what type of... Uh, equipment we're going to need for that, supplies. So you're going to need a piece of white paper. 
you're going to need some construction paper, you're going to need some glue, you're going to need some scissors, and you're going to need some crayons and markers. Okay, I hope everybody has that in their house. I look forward to seeing you again next Sunday when we'll do our craft, and I hope that everybody has a blessed week. Bye-bye.